Hi, this is Dr. Pan recording from Tucson, Arizona. I hope life is treating you well and thank you for watching this clip on order of operation. This is the last batch of the arithmetic. So in the grand scheme of things, here we have arithmetic. And then you have the pre-algebra, this is the transition area, and then you have the algebra as one and two, and then geometry, and you move on to trig. Okay, so this is the last 80 bits end before you get into the pre-algebra. Okay, so now, in order to figure this one out, we need another pyramid, or a little triangle. This one is fun. Please excuse, multiply, divide, add, and subtract. Multiply, divide, this is exponentials, and then this is parentheses. Okay, so you can remember it's a panda, or please excuse my dear Aunt Sally, whatever works for you. Okay, so back on to here, let's take a look. Minus nine, let's leave it outside. We gotta take care of the bracket first. This is the parentheses first. And then this chunk, maybe take a look, this chunk is multiplying, multiplying, multiplying. Oh, and then here we have adding. So here's the three chunks. We have a 12 minus, we gotta take care of this one. If you multiply this whole thing together, minus five times four, uh, eight is 40, times three is 120, minus minus makes a positive 120 over here. Okay, so minus 120. Okay, so this whole chunk is plus 120. And then we'll have a plus one. Okay. Next thing, when you have two numbers, but with two operators, adding and subtracting, the first thing you wanna do is you wanna combine it. If it's add and subtract together is a negative sign. If two people or two friends can't agree on something, that's really bad, subtracting bad for the two numbers. Okay, so if we use that, we have not minus nine, 12 minus 120, and then add one. The answer is gonna be negative, and it's 100 and 107. Let me make sure I get it myself right so I don't give you any wrong answers. 107 over here, Minus, minus, when there are in agreement, multiplication give you a positive. A positive in 136 is your final answer, okay? My kids are home from school. Yay, summertime. Okay, back to math. So a quick uh, review. This is uh, material-wise, this is the beginning of the algebra. This is some uh, good material coming up. And in order to do order of operation, remember, please excuse my dear aunt for add Sally. Now, incidentally, when you have this chunk all by itself, it goes from left to right. Okay, so the order stays the same way unless they're on top of each other. For this particular problem, I always tell my students, slow down. It's a lot easier to go slow the first time, but get the right answer instead of going back, trying to recheck it and find where your mistake is. All right, now that's how we handle this problem. Once again, from Tucson, Arizona, this is Dr. Pam making learning math fun and easy. Well, it's trying to. Please comment or thumb up if this has been helpful. Until next time. Have a confident day.